This is One Direction's latest single, but could it now be one of their last? The biggest boy band on the planet right now is rumoured to be heading for a break in four different directions for the next year at least. Today, the man who broke the story and the hearts of millions of fans says it's not a permanent split. Well, not yet, anyway. They will be going on a year-long hiatus from March, and obviously that time gives them the opportunity to do their own thing and to launch solo projects. And I guess when they get back together, or if they get back together, depends on how those projects go. Since being formed on The X Factor five years ago, One Direction have continually topped the charts, with 50 million records sold worldwide. But if Zayn's departure wasn't enough turmoil for fans, today's news pushed Directioners, as they're called, into meltdown online. One wrote, not to be overdramatic, but One Direction is over, and so is my whole life. And another said, I've never cried harder. While a Directioner's dad wrote, my eight-year-old just shook as she read the One Direction news on my phone, before calmly putting it down, saying, I'm never talking again. So which direction will they go? Well, if the rumours are true, Harry could be headed for Hollywood. And there's already talk of Louis joining next year's X Factor as a judge, while Niall is thought to want to become a solo pop star, and Liam is keen to carry on songwriting and DJing. Baby now. One man who knows all about being in a boy band is Scott Robinson from Five. Today, he told Five News he thinks it's the wrong decision. I actually think they're still rising. Um, I think it's possibly a bad decision to stop now. Uh, you know, new singles, fantastic. You know, they're sort of even now had more sort of adult music. It's sounding a little bit more, you know, real. And um, I think it's the wrong time. So Directioners make the most of their new single. Come March next year, the band will be taking a break from the airwaves. Charlotte Grant, Five News.